I know we do have some rain coming into the Bay Area, but so far a lot of our microclimates are still dry. Just seeing these clouds rolling by overhead. Live look outside in San Jose. So with that rain returning today, we're going to see the wind picking up, especially for this afternoon. We are going to have gusts at 20 to 30 miles per hour, and that could bring down some trees. So just a heads up about that. The rain won't be nearly as heavy as what we had over the weekend, but it is coming on an already saturated ground. We could see about a quarter to three quarters of an inch of rain, and the Sierra could see another four to nine inches of snow. As of right now, we're starting to see it moving on to the coast, and m many areas farther to the north are starting to see the conditions changing there very quickly. As we get a closer look at Storm Ranger, that's our mobile Doppler radar, the red scan that you're seeing there. We have it parked on San Bruno Mountain. If you have the NBC Bay Area app, you can tap on the little Storm Ranger icon and you can see what we're seeing right here in the studio. We're seeing a lot of that rain starting to move into Marin County, but uh, maybe evaporating before it hits the ground as of now. But we'll continue to see the atmosphere moisten up a little bit more and then that rain will make it all the way to the ground. And then here we are at noon where we start to see some pockets of some heavier rain moving into San Francisco, parts of the East Bay, still some light showers in the North Bay, but at any point we could see the intensity of that rain picking up where we see the yellows and the oranges indicating some heavy rain moving through parts of Contra Costa as well as Alameda counties and then moving into parts of the North Bay as well. Going into the evening commute, that's going to be a mess. You do want to allow some extra time to get home as we are going to see the rain picking up across parts of the Bay Area, but then it does quickly taper off later this evening. Then we turn our attention to the next storm system coming in. This will be another atmospheric river moving in between Wednesday and Thursday, another weak storm on Saturday, and then a potentially a third storm behind that next Monday into Tuesday. So we're going to be very busy here. But what we see today, most of us getting about a quarter inch of rain, uh, maybe a little bit higher, but here's what's ahead. A couple of more inches, possibly, look at that, over 10 inches of rain for parts of the North Bay by next week. Wow, look at that. That's a live view of Tahoe. I already miss it. It's going to be beautiful there. It's only 18 degrees, though, and we are seeing a, a big dose of that heavy snow, giving us a boost of 187 percent of our normal amount of snow. And there's more on the way as we go toward the end of the week. There could possibly be another 37 to 74 inches of snow through next week. So here's what's ahead for us. A lot of active weather a lot of rain and very few breaks. We do get a break tomorrow as well as Friday, but we'll turn our attention to that big storm setting its sight on the Bay Area heading into Wednesday and Thursday. Lauren Scott.